Hello Cancerians, welcome to your reading, welcome back, I'm sending you so much love and light. Let's begin this message for you Cancer, take what resonates and leave the rest, I'm seeing your card, the chariot at the bottom of the deck. Let's begin this reading, three of wands, actually two of wands, someone's taking action towards you, give me an energy for Cancer, someone rising in Venus. We have an apology coming through. There's a person that, that has a decision here to make. Could be an Aquarius. You may not be speaking to this energy with the Two of Swords. There's a mental conflict that's happening with this person. Page of Cups is a message that's coming through. I said it. There's somebody that wants to communicate with you. This person is afraid to take a leap here towards you. Aquarius energy, the Fool. This person may be apologizing to you because they feel foolish. They feel like they've made, they made a mistake in the past. But someone's afraid here to begin a new cycle. I feel like this person made a mistake here with either obligations or a third party, a karmic partner. It's an external party situation. In reflection, doing shadow work. I'm seeing temperance, temperance, which is Sagittarius energy. So the four of swords, there's a healing that's taking place with this person that could be in reflection. This could be a masculine that's having an epiphany, meaning a sudden wake up call, an energy shift. This person could feel depleted because I'm seeing now the four of swords. There's a need now to recover. Waiting, waiting, okay, wanting time alone. I said waiting, so I channel waiting, so somebody here could be waiting. But wanting time alone in retreat. Sagittarius, number 14, may resonate. Four of Swords is here with his temperance. It's a need now to recover. This person's in reflection, soul searching, wanting time alone and waiting. Could be deep introspection, making an evaluation. Knight of Cups. We have Page of Cups, Knight of Cups, Water Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This energy is watching you with the Page of Swords, meaning learning something new about you. There's a, There's been a change. Eight of Wands could be relocation. Eight of Wands could also be communication. What is this fool in the reverse? This is someone that kept their feelings at bay. This person did not disclose how they felt to you, blocked emotions. They are watching you. It says here, observing, hiding their feelings, being silent, secretive, blocking emotions and wearing a mask. This is someone that feels like that that was their mistake, okay? To wear a mask and not tell you how they felt. I see an emotional confession coming through with something you have manifested. Long-term security rewards. Spirit guides are showing someone's being guided right now, closed off. I'm seeing a masculine energy in all of these three cards, okay? Someone who has been resistant and blocking because of their pride. Defensive. This is the Nine of Wands, the Wounded Warrior. I'm seeing the Page of Swords here. This is someone from your past, Cancer. Look in the Ace of Pentacles. King of Pentacles never, never fails. The King of Pentacles is under this magician. Gemini and Virgo. It's about a manifestation. Look, I have the Ace of Pentacles here. A stable romance, a new financial start, prosperity, a reward, long-term security. Someone's thinking about you, reminiscing Six of Cups. This is a past life soulmate, Page of Source that's watching you. I'm seeing this King of Pentacles here. This was the same energy in yesterday's reading. This King of Pentacles with the Queen of Source. I've been shuffling this deck. You're in a Queen of Swords energy with somebody. I have been seeing it in the readings. It's it's like you know that you know. The world, the world showed yesterday. Look, this divine feminine here showing with the Ten of Wands. You are releasing a, but something here from your past. I just saw the Five of Cups, meaning sorrow, disappointment from your past. That is what you're letting go of, okay? Page of Swords, Six of Cups. I'm seeing feminine energy again. A wish fulfillment for this, for a wish fulfillment. If you are a feminine energy, we all have feminine and masculine, okay? A wish fulfillment, nine of cups. There's a happy outcome here for you. I see this as a stable new beginning. It's a stable new beginning. Why does this person feel 
I'm going to clarify this full energy in the reverse. I think I was, this is somebody who was resistant to take a leap towards you or they feel like they made a mistake. This is why they're so searching. Evaluation could be a Virgo. This is hermit energy, which was strong in the reading. There's an epiphany shift here and a, an emotional confession with an apology com coming through. I'm seeing this Ace of Pentacles as something that you are manifesting. You have manifested this new beginning. Something to do with healing, healing of an inner child, healing, coping, poor coping mechanisms. There's something to do with learned behaviors, patterns, repeated patterns. Spirit guides again showing. Let's clarify before we move on. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Someone's in reflection that they were playing too hard or playing the field too hard or being resistant to a change. We have retreat wanting time alone. Look, we have I, we saw this earlier. Time alone or in nature will help you recharge. Hermit mode in retreat. There's children. children. Children may be a factor in this connection. Addictions also an addiction. We have second chance relationship. You may be rejecting this energy or this rejection. Look, we have release, stability, stable romance, and we have stability, forgiveness. That there's the apology that I'm channeling. We have the Page of Cups. That's, that's how I see the Page of Cups. And it's coming in with an emotional confession. Okay. This relationship can stand the test of time. Someone seeing you stable, Cancer, grounded, stable. I saw you as a Queen of Pentacles. Fate is at the bottom of the deck. This is a destined partnership. Let's clarify Ace of Cups, Five of Wands, Queen of Wands. Someone may be arguing with this Queen of Wands because of emotions, because of a new beginning. Nine of Swords, there's the stress, there's the full energy. Somebody here wants to take a leap, but it's full showed in the reverse. So it's there's a hesitant hesitancy to take to take some sort of risk here. Someone might have taken a risk here and this bag could have backfired for them. Let's see. What is this full energy in the reverse? See this person coming in to apologize to you with an, with an apology. What is this full energy in the reverse? Wounded warrior, defensive. This is somebody that wants to try again. Yeah. This is someone from your past coming back. Judgment. And there's a four of swords. We have the four of swords here. There's a healing taking place. This, this person is meditating on something, contemplating, perhaps even thinking about you. So we have epiphany. There's been a breakthrough here, sudden wake up call, energy shift. They're answering to the calling. There's something here that they're answering to. Yeah, judgment. And we have the moon in the reverse. This could happen around the next full moon. I feel like the emotions here are going to be exposed. The moon in the reverse are things that were once hidden now coming to the surface. This energy of things being exposed has been showing in the readings. The judgment is about things things being resurrected. I feel like there's somebody that has been hesitant, resistant to come forward. You know, this person could be making a judgment call to reveal their emotions to you. This judgment also someone someone that that feels like they're being like they're being judged for a mistake that they made. A leap they took in the past. What is this communication? Page? Look, and I'm seeing the fool again. Aquarius energy. Aries. Nine of swords. This person feels like they made a mistake. They feel foolish. Because you sit in this queen of pentacles energy now. They see you as the ultimate catch. Stable. Grounded. Nurturing. Could be a mother. Eight of swords. Thinking about you. Nine of swords. Eight of swords. There's a lot of anxiety about this leap that someone is taking. Emotions will be revealed. We have the Knight of Cups, Page of Cups, Water Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We have Pisces here with this Moon and Scorpio with this Judgment. Nine of Swords. Nine of Swords. Is somebody that's in distress coming forward to ask for your forgiveness? This person is alone. Time alone or in nature. I don't think that this energy is in nature. I think they're at home. Four of Swords. That's how I see this person. And the Four of Swords, Nine of Swords. A lot of mental a lot of mental, I was going to say mental stagnation. There's the Page of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles. 
Knight of Knight and Eight of Wands. This is communication with a page with a page of cups. This is communication. Someone here may be too emotional when they communicate. The moon in the reverse and the page of cups in the reverse. It's a lot of emotions. Could be I see this as a masculine yang energy. Ace of Wands. Could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Who's ready here to come forward? Two of Wands. Give me one more energy for this communication. There it is. The Ace of Cups and the Queen of Swords. And I'm seeing the Four of Cups. This, this is emotions that someone here is coming forward communicating to you. I feel like you, I feel like you know better now. I, I don't know why I'm channeling that energy. The, the Queen of Swords. You may have air in your chart, Cancer, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You're going to be telling somebody here the truth. Six of Cups, Past Life Soulmate. This is somebody here from your past that's watching you with the Page of Swords. This person's going to be emotional. Okay, Ace of Cups is showing, look at the tower, a life change. This message, news, text, phone call, expression, email, it's coming in unexpected, suddenly. I see there's, I see a masculine that is in their emotions right now. This person's alone. They're contemplating perhaps coming into balance or healing or moderation. There's, there's a need for moderation here. Temperance energy. Seeing the Page of Swords again with the Six of Cups. This is a past life soulmate who's watching you. I feel like I'm showing the same cards. Every deck it's showing the same cards. The Magician. And here's the Tower with this Ace of Cups. You, you may not be expecting this. Emotional confession from this energy. You may not be expecting this. Page of Wands. And there's a fool again. Oh, my God. This person feels like they need to make things right between the two of you. Libra, Aquarius, and the Page of Wands. This is good news. This is good news coming through. What was I going to? Was I going to use this deck? Yeah. Give me an energy for this reading for Cancer. Forgiveness is what somebody's coming forward with. We have the Page of Cups twice in the reading, an emotional confession. You're going to be analyzing this. Intimacy bond. This person feels like they have... It says you're sensual. Someone may want to be intimate with you. I'm just going to say that. This energy may be from New York. New York may resonate for somebody. Give me one more energy. Time waiting, waiting. I channel this energy. Somebody's waiting, in alone waiting. Seeing you, seeing you as graceful, kind-hearted, charming, beautiful. That is that has been the epiphany. That has been their karma. Consequences. This is the justice energy. Debts, cause and effect, consequences. Give me one more energy. See, I see a masculine in this card waiting. looking at their watch waiting and one more energy spying this person spying social network information i said it page of swords but thinking also a lot about the past energies reminiscing okay let me get one more let me get one more energy for cancer give me one second look we have soulmates here deep love and unity i'm seeing the moon again at the bottom of the deck with the Ten of Pentacles and the Judgment. The Judgment is showing. Oh my goodness. Someone's from your past is coming in to reconcile. With the Six of Pentacles. This person's coming in to give you something. To balance the scales with you. I'm seeing the Ace of Cups here. Yes, and the Seven of Swords. For some reason, I feel like this has been a repeated pattern with somebody you don't you may not trust this energy. I channeled that. that I channel, Didn't I channel that message? You may not trust this person. That is why you're in the Queen of Swords energy. Six of Swords because you are transitioning. I'm seeing the King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, who's, who has the hearts for you. I mean, this person has passion, passion for you, desire. They want to they initiate something with you, a new beginning. The Fool and the Temperance. We have it here. The Fool and the Temperance, Sagittarius and I was going to say Libra. We have Taurus, Aquarius. Thinking about an offer they want to make to you. Ace of Cups twice. We have Soulmate. 
what is this judgment what is this page of cups here i feel like is this person here in the reverse coming in in the reverse coming in from your past this is a destined partnership i have the ten of swords aquarius two of swords the two of pentacles there's a decision this person's making between two people okay have the ten of swords with the nine of pentacles this person's single they have there's something here that has ended and they're single nine of pentacles something has ended with this person they're coming forward communicating with you you may not be in communication here with this energy that's why they're watching you i mean it makes sense if someone's spying on you because you're not speaking to them right <laughs> that's how i see it two of pentacles and the two of swords 22 you may be seeing two 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 there is a release that is what I see here with this Ten of Swords. There's a release here in someone single, Nine of Pentacles. Forgiveness is what this energy is coming towards you, asking you for a forgiveness. They're still hopeful. This person's still hopeful that they can have a new beginning. There's a lot of emotions here. The moon in the reverse is, is somebody may be emotional. This person may have a hard time speaking. And the tower here. Clarify this tower for me. Let me get one more for Cancer. It is about a realization, an epiphany, okay? Four of Cups, disappointment. Yeah, disappointment, look at this. I saw the Three of Swords, time. This person feels like they're waiting, waiting or running out of time. Wheel of Fortune and the Seven of Pentacles. Three of Swords, heartbroken about this connection with you, Leo energy. You, you might have overcame a disappointment from the past with this person there's a soul connection here with this energy gemini and the wheel of fortune three of swords this cycle of the, i feel like this cycle with a third party has also come to a finish there's an attraction to you okay i did i did channel that energy from this masculine the sun four of pentacles This energy is coming towards you to reveal the truth, okay? Because they've been holding on to it. This, this is somebody that has been holding on to this connection with you. Aries energy, I have a new romantic cycle begins for you. The sun, the sun is um, the truth being exposed. Aquarius again, show the world the real you. Don't let your past hold you back. Somebody's going to expose something to you. Show the world the real you. This is something that a person here is disclosing, meaning showing you. Aquarius energy. South Node is about an energy that has been resistant, resistant to let go of something. They're, they have they have looked at the big, the picture differently, looking at the bigger picture. It's time to release negativity. Scorpio, Sagittarius. So energy is working through their fears. A new romantic cycle is beginning. Libra energy. Give me one more energy for this reading for Cancer. Give me one more energy. Work through your fears. This person's working through their fears. Scorpio, luck is on your side. Prosperity lies ahead. That was that was in yesterday's reading. This energy doesn't feel confident here to come forward. Doesn't have to be a Leo, but I'm seeing this card in the reverse. Confidence is the key to your success. Someone doesn't feel confident, and that's that is the message I channeled. King of Wands, look at this. King of Wands and the Lovers. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They don't. They lack the confidence to come forward, but they're working. Somebody here is going to take action regardless, because conclusions are within. Meaning some, this person knows knows what they need to do. I feel like somebody has been holding on and resistant because of fears or limitations. Perhaps they, they, they lacked confidence as well. See this person single. Prosperity lies ahead for you. Luck is on your side. A new romantic cycle is beginning. I said it here with this Ace of Pentacles. This is a manifestation. Something you've manifested, Cancer. A stable romance for you get some of these energies for you to end this reading everything i said confirmation yes gemini fire sign aries leo sagittarius the scales are in your favor we have a wish granted yeah the scales are in your favor i'm also channeling this person didn't have success elsewhere i'm also that that is why the scales are showing Someone could be lacking success where they're, where they're at at this time. Okay, that, that is why the full showed in the reverse, okay? Protect your energy. We have Scorpio. Blessings on the way. So protect your energy. There's been a transformation. 
me an energy for this reading. Cancer. Yeah, look, the star is showing again, magic reversed, showing this, the star energy, which is a wish granted, is showing in the reverse. Somebody here wanted to block this blessing for you. The Wheel of Fortune in Aries. This could be someone in your family, Cancer. This could be a family situation because I said protect your energy. Now we have magic reversed. There's somebody that does not want you to have this wish fulfillment because I saw this wish granted. It wanted to show it. This success wanted to show in the reverse. Protect your energy. Now, blessing that's on the way. That's the, that's the tower. That is the tower. I just channeled that. So yeah, this emperor, masculine energy didn't have success meaning it's just like that saying you know the grass wasn't exactly greener on the other side the world the world is showing so it's, it's a completion of a cycle the grass wasn't greener okay and something has been reversed forgiveness is needed okay this is this is somebody that's going to come going to try to come back now and try to ask you for your for try to ask for forgiveness from you cancer can we talk Feel like that is what this person is going to say can we please talk could be a virgo that is their tower at a long distance i didn't expect to fall in love with you i'm texting you someone here loves you yeah that is their karmic justice and i saw it in the reading yesterday i saw that you you guys pulling your energy back from somebody who's going to now want to try to come back i'm also going to say look i'm seeing this communication with this eight of wands as i pick up this deck you know and that, that has been showing you are divinely protected that's what I'm going to say in this reading. But I also wanted to mention a few things. You know, I've noticed as the channel continues to grow, um, more other impersonators of other channels which take my photo and leave comments in the comment section. Just know that I would not ask you for, and I'm, I'm channeling this energy because I'm seeing it here. You are protected. So if you see a comment from somebody that that's asking or providing you with a link, please just report and block. I don't know what happened yesterday. There were three channels that were impersonating me. And, you know, I reported all three. I'm afraid of you moving on. Capricorn energy. But just use discernment. I, would, I wouldn't message you ask, to ask you for donations. I felt the need to mention that during the reading. So, and I'm not turning off the comments either. The comment section is a place for you guys to support one another. I have kept so many things from you. We have something, we have communication that's coming through very soon for you. Could be from a Libra Cancer. So anyway, I didn't mean to interrupt the reading with that message, but someone needs to hear this. We have Pisces, unexpected message, Taurus, when you feel my energies because I'm thinking about you, no one compares to you. Soul contract, by the next full moon, something here backfire for this person. Something could have backfired for this energy. And somebody else, somebody that they chose. Allow your heart to play, to allow your heart to and soul to sing with joy. Allow your heart to play. Wow. Calling in your soulmate. We have very soon again. Calling in your soulmate. We have reconciliation. Letting go of control issues. Let your friends help you. We have deception and engagement. I feel like somebody could have been wearing a mask, a self self deceptive mask, you know, not not showing not showing their true feelings. This energy could be seeking support now. We have engagement. Someone's love life is ascending towards the next level. I said it. Someone from your past is returning to your life very soon. Calling in your soulmate. We have engagement, passion. I feel like somebody here deceived themselves. You know, this passion wanted to show kind of sideways there's no more passion here if somebody's involved in a new situation there's no more passion this person's allowing their friends to help them or give them support assist them we have heart-to-heart -heart conversation we have new love a new person has stirred your romantic feelings i don't know if you're going to meet someone new and then you're going to have a past person come in because i see a stable romance and this card wanted to show this new love now i'm seeing forgiveness in the reverse you may not want to forgive this past energy someone from your past it will be coming forward apologizing to you but i also see new love a new person that will be stirring your romantic feelings cancer does that make sense does it does to me someone from your past is returning 
honestly discuss your feelings. This person is going to reveal emotions to you. This is someone that does have romantic feelings for you. But this is, again, somebody you don't, you don't trust because this is somebody that could have been deceptive in the past. You don't trust this person. We have forgiveness wanting to show in the reverse. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in the present moment. I feel like some of you are releasing the past and meeting a new person. And that is usually how it happens. I just see here reconciling someone from your past is returning. You don't have to reconcile with this person. Okay, but someone from your past is coming forward with communication and an apology. They feel like they owe it to you. Okay, your love life is ascending. You may even get engaged to this new new energy. This is a soulmate that you have been calling in. This is happening for you. I feel like this is going to happen very fast, very quickly. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. So, Cancer, this is what I have for you for today. Let me know if this resonated. I love you guys. Sending you all so much love and light. Thank you for liking and subscribing to the channel. It does help the channel. I'll be back soon. Until next reading, namaste.